All right, people, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can host this sales page on your own domain, all right? Because you can see that this sales page is currently sitting on customketodiet.com, all right? And that's not my domain name, I don't own that, okay? That's the domain name of the product, and I want to host this sales page on my domain, which is easyhealthtips.com, all right? And I'm gonna show you how you can download this and just upload it onto our domain really easily okay now um, what's the product that I'm looking at here this is called the custom keto diet okay and it's actually a product in Clickbank and it's one of the top sellers okay so I've ranked these high to low for the best selling products on Clickbank and if you just scroll down you can see that custom keto diet is sitting right here on page one okay so this one's doing really well could be a really good one to promote okay now the first thing that we want to do is we actually want to come to the affiliate page, okay? So you want to come and open the Custom Keto Diet affiliate page, and it's going to look just like this, all right? And that's going to allow us to scroll down. We can find landing pages, all right? And it says here, if you want to host our sales page on your domain, you can download the file on this page and upload them to your own server, all right? Now, I just spent the past half hour figuring this out because uh, it took a bit of trial and error. I've cracked it, I know how to do it, I'm gonna show you how to do it, okay? So um, let's uh, let's get in there. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna click here to download, okay? So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna download that, all right? And we'll let that download for a sec. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna actually wanna change one thing. Okay, that once it's downloaded, we're gonna to wanna to change one thing. And it says here, look, you can see here, please make sure to add your ClickBank ID into the custom keto diet button hyperlink, okay? So where it says XXXXX here, you're gonna put your ClickBank ID, all right? Your ClickBank ID. Now, um, you probably know your ClickBank ID already, but just in case you don't, let me show you how you can find it, okay? So if I was to come to um, the marketplace if I was going to go and promote this all right let's just hit this promote button all right and you can see account nickname for me Nick Roberts it's Nick Rowe okay Nick Rowe that's my um, Clickbank ID so that's the thing that I'm going to go in and insert okay where it said XXX I'll show you how to do this okay so let me just close that down remember if you don't know your you know if you don't know your Clickbank ID Bam, just hit promote, you can always find it there, okay? Go and use your one, all right? So, um, actually, let me just copy and paste that because I'm gonna need it. So let me just copy that, okay? And we should be downloaded by now. Yeah, we are, we're downloaded. So I'm just gonna, um, just gonna minimize that for a second. And here we go. So this is what you're gonna have. You're gonna have this custom keto diet zip file, okay? So you just wanna double click, all right? And then you're gonna, get this folder, okay? And what I'm gonna do is we're just gonna open the folder up, okay? Open the folder up, and you're gonna to wanna to hit the index page, okay? This is the thing that we're just gonna modify, okay? So you're gonna hit the index page. But watch what happens. If you just open the index page like that, it opens up, all right? You can't modify it in any way. You can't do anything to it, okay? So what we're gonna to wanna to do is we're gonna to wanna to right click, okay? You wanna right click, and you're gonna go and open with, and you want to open it with text edit. All right, this is really important. Open it with text edit, and you're going to get the code. All right, you're going to get the code that looks like this. Now, if you don't see this code immediately, okay, there's something that you need to do. You need to come over to text edit preferences. All right, you want to go to preferences, and where it says open and save, there's this thing here display HTML files. Okay. So if that's not ticked, watch what happens if this is not ticked, okay? If I open that, open with text edit, I just get that, all right? I can't modify the code. So what you wanna do, one more time, text edit, just hit text edit, preferences, open and save, and you just wanna tick that, display HTML code, all right? And then I can just close that, and then we'll go at it one more time, um, open with, text edit, and now you can see I'm seeing the code. So just in case you weren't seeing it, you just wanna tick that little box, all right? So next thing is, I'm just gonna open it up nice and big. Remember, we're looking for basically that XXXX, okay? There's only one place that we wanna put our thing. And I'll show you where it is. You actually just wanna scroll down, and you can see it right here. 
Okay, you can see it right here. This is your hop clip bank. Can you see that? Hopclipbank.net. And you just want to go and you want to put your ID in there. Paste. Nick Rowe. Okay, that's me. All right, go and paste your ID in there. And then you're just going to hit save. Okay, going to hit save. And you can close that down. And just to double check that it's working, but we will test this later. But just to double check that's working, open with text edit one more time. Just scroll down, go find your um, go find your ClickBank ID, wherever it is. I've lost it now, and um, there it is. You can see there, and that that saved. Okay, Nick Rowe. You see that? That saved. Okay, so that's what you want to do. That's the way you edit it. And this is this is going to make sure that anyone who hits that button on the sales page, it's going to go through to your affiliate link. Okay, so this is. Um, really important step all right so let's just close that down happy with that and now I'm going to show you how to upload it to your WordPress site okay so just make sure I'm bloody recording I am recording okay I'm recording I've, the amount of times I've been chatting away to myself for a good 20 minutes and I'm not recording so um, we're all good we're all good right so where are we okay here we go I want to get into my WordPress site all right so this is where it gets a little bit technical, but it's not that hard. It's only copy and paste. All right. So don't be thrown off by the technical side. It's just a matter of copy and paste. Okay. So what we want to do first of all is we want to install a plugin. All right. So let's go to plugins, add new. All right. Plugins, add new. I'm just going to close this little thing and I'm just going to type in WordPress file manager. All right. WordPress file manager. All right. It's this one. It's this one here, all right? It just says it's got that WordPress W. It looks just like this, okay? File Manager. Look, 700,000 active installations, okay? Banging reviews, a lot of people using it. Updated four weeks ago. It's compatible. This is the perfect one for us, okay? Go and install that, all right? Go and install that. And uh, once, that in what's that? once that's installed, we'll activate it. Okay, we're good. Um, so uh, now, okay, now you can see over here. I hope my face ain't in the way, but you can actually go and you can see this folder here. All right, um, guys, my face might possibly be in the way. I just want you to scroll down, scroll down, plugins, users, tools, settings. It's just going to be sitting just below there. WordPress File Manager. Just go and click on it. All right, just go and click on it. Um, forget that. Don't need that for the moment. And you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna have this. All right, you're gonna see this screen. All right. Now, what we want to do is we're just gonna go and create a new folder. All right, go and create a new folder. So, to do that, you see you got an arrow, left arrow, right arrow, up arrow, and then you got the next button along. It says new folder. Okay, you can see that fourth one. Just smash that, and I'm just gonna call this index. Okay, I'm gonna call it index. All right, and uh, hit enter. Okay, there you go. That's our folder created. All right, now I'm going to click into it. Okay, I'm going to click into that and I'm just going to come and I'm going to go back to our, um, I'm going to go back to our folder here with all our custom keto stuff in. Okay, got all our custom keto stuff in there. And I'm just going to literally drag everything in. All right, just drag the whole lot in and bam. And that should all upload. You can see that's uploading now, all right. And what that, what that, what's that doing whilst, uh, whilst that's loading up, is it's going to load up the HTML pages for us. Okay, so these pages are going to now load. They're going to look just like this one. All right, so that's really cool. Um, it's so it's uploading all these pages. We're going to get a privacy page as well. If people don't want to, if people don't want to watch the sales video, we're going to get the read page. Um, there's also a scientific references page that gives it more credibility. They've got access to that. There's a terms and conditions page as well. So these are all going to be loaded up for you. It's going to have the um, the Favicon, which I don't even know what bloody Favicon is, uh, some kind of logo, I guess. And then it's got the fonts and just um, everything you need to make this page look like the real thing. Okay, and uh, it's just pulling all that in now. All right, it's just pulling all that in now for us. So um, I'm just going to leave that for a minute. But um, basically, once that's done, um, it's done. All right, it's done. You will now have on 
on your domain, so my domain, easyhealthtips.com, you will now have this page here. All right, you will have this page here, um, but it's gonna be sitting on your domain, which means that you can start running Facebook ads, Google ads, or whatever ads you like to it, okay? Facebook and Google, they don't like you direct linking to um, affiliate links, okay? Um, it's not going to work. So you want to go ahead and uh, go through this step. Okay. And that looks good. All right. That looks all set up. So you can see I've now got my index folder here. Yeah. I've got my index folder here. That's my new one that we just set up. If I click in, it's got all the things. All right. So now what I do is I'll actually come and let's go and test it. All right. Let's go and actually test it. So I'm going to come over here and I'm just going to type in easyhealthtips.com. All right. And I'm going to just do that forward slash sort of thing. And because we call our folder index, we're just gonna do forward slash index. So this is your link, okay, where the page is gonna sit. And let, I hope this worked, I really hope this worked. It did work, yes! Moment of truth, it pulled through. All right, so um, there you go, and check this out. Look, Would you like to it's got the video, it's got everything sitting up. And look at this, it's on my domain easyhealthtips.com so now when I set up a Google ad or Facebook ad or whatever um, I can give I can use this link people can hit this link and they're gonna come to this page this is on my domain okay you've got all the privacies okay they're all working fine you see that how easy was that we've got full full working affiliate website um, up and running in how long did that take us 10 minutes I guess so you see you've got all these pages that open up smoothly um, you can prefer to read, all right? Let's just open that in a new tab. I'll show you what that looks like. They've got the prefer to read. So for anyone who prefers to read, that looks like it didn't work so well, okay? I'll have to, um, that looks like it didn't work so well. And I'm not sure why that is, but uh, let me just try that one more time. Um, looks like it's got a few images missing. So sorry about that. But um, if, I, uh, if I figure out why that is, I'll just make another video just after this one, okay? So um, don't worry about that for now. But most people are gonna be watching the video anyway, okay? And if, as I said, if I do find the fix for that, I'll make another video for you, okay? But uh, this is the most important thing. Let's go and test our funnel, all right? So this button, this should take us to our hop link, okay? Our ClickBank affiliate link, okay? So let's hit the button and let's see what it does, okay? So it's going to take us to customketodiet.com. So we're now back to the customketodiet.com domain. All right, I'm no longer on Easy Health Tips. I'm no longer on my domain. I'm on their domain, okay? Now I want to be sure that um, the sales are getting you know, tracked to me. So let's just go through the funnel, all right? And the funnel's sweet, you know? It's got this little, um, it's got this little sort of questionnaire sort of thing. It's really interactive. I think this funnel is going to convert really really well um people are gonna people are gonna have fun going through this it's really beautiful and i'm just gonna fire through this real quick um uh about 85 don't really weigh myself spare myself the uh, the pain of looking <laughs> and here we go so they'd be taken here all right and then they can go and get their diet plan get it now okay got to drop in an email so let me just drop in an email okay get your custom keto so this is what the customer will be doing um, and it would hit here okay and then now we're taking to the order page all right and now this is the moment of truth here is this should go through to my Clickbank affiliate ID okay and let's just see if it does so we've been taken here and the way you see is just skip down to the bottom and you can see here so we are actually on the clickbank page here and you can see here affiliate nick row okay so that whole funnel ends on this page and it's got my affiliate id on it so i'll get the sale so that's it bang him absolutely bang him well pleased with that well pleased with that okay let's just do that one more time bam full affiliate site ready to go all right and uh, i've got to say big you know hats off and a big shout out to custom keto diet for actually um giving us this you know this is really really cool saves you so much time having to go and 
you know, make your own page or try and clone this. Okay, this is really sweet. And this will work for any other, any other, um, you know, any other uh, company who's giving you a landing page to download. This is exactly the same process. So once you've seen how to do it here once, you can go and do this. Okay, if you find other people who are allowing you to download their page, same steps all right so absolutely sorted um so that's it for this video as i said if i do um if i do find the fix for this um i will yeah i'll just make a, another video to go alongside this all right so look out for that and um but that's it yeah go load up your page i hope you enjoy this one and uh keep killing it online okay i'll talk to you real soon